The death of a University of Pennsylvania student has shaken the campus. Nathaniel Gordon was a sophomore who passed away over the weekend. Tonight, it's still unclear what led to his death as his friends and family are doing the best to cope with the loss. Monday night in the big story on Action News is the sudden death of a University of Pennsylvania student. Action News reporter John Paul live for us now on campus in University City with the details. John. Yeah, Shari Rick, students are invited here to Houston Hall to get support after the passing of Nathaniel Gordon. You know, he has quite a story, overcoming so many obstacles, eventually becoming an intern for State Senator Sharif Street and getting into Penn. But over the weekend, we learned he died. By all accounts, Nathaniel Gordon had a bright future. Here he is posing with Senator John Fetterman in 2022. And another picture was State Senator Sharif Street who talked to us today. He was uh, intellectually curious, friendly, um, wanting to get engaged, uh, really smart uh, young man who we thought had the uh, world in front of him. Gordon did not have it easy. He had family challenges and aged out of foster care. He also disengaged from high school, but his life turned around when he got into the Community College of Philadelphia's Gateway to College program. It helped him graduate high school and earn college credits. He went on to become the first Gateway student to get into an Ivy League school. Nate was a quiet storm. He was very persistent. Um, he was incredibly curious, and he just seemed like he was on the right path. And Penn was challenging for him, but he was overcoming, and he was, he was meeting that challenge. Officials at Penn are tight-lipped about what happened to Gordon. They put out a statement confirming his death. Red crime scene tape is still left outside Mayor Residence Hall, where we're told he died on Saturday. However, police, Penn officials, and the medical examiner are not revealing any information on the circumstances surrounding his death. What is clear? The sophomore touched many lives and leaves a legacy behind. We made an impression on him, and he made an impression on us. I am a religious person. I believe you know God doesn't make mistakes, but certainly hard to figure out why this happened. Now, the university did notify the student body of his passing on Sunday. They say they will continue in, uh, offering support and services to any student who needs it. We're live tonight on Penn's campus in University City. John Paul, Channel 6 Action News. Rick, Shari. Right. John, thank you.